What's up YouTube, it's your boy Ashadan11 and in this video I'm going to show you how to jailbreak 4.3.5 with the new Red Snow that was released last night and it's really, there's a lot of different stuff in this one but it's way better and first I'm going to show you all that I'm on 4.3.5 there it is right there, 4.3.5 and the Red Snow right here and I'm going to click on Red Snow first. You want to go to, you want to right click on it, then go to Properties, Compatibility, and you want to run as Service Pack 2. Then you want to hit, when you want to run as Administrator, then Apply, then OK. Then you want to open it up. And see the, the new red snow, all you see just jailbreak and extra. The extra is for like if you got a beta ver version, you could just do that. You could just boot tether, all that stuff. But I'm not going to show you all that. Let's go back. You want to hit jailbreak, then you want to put your device in the DFU mode. Just want to hold on to the home and power. But for first, you want to hold on to the home and power button for 10 seconds. So, one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Release the power button. Keep holding on the home button for another ten seconds. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And there you go. See Red Snow already start doing this thing. And for the 4.3.5, this is a tether jailbreak, so I'm gonna have to come back again and just boot tether. See right up here, it shows you all the firmware is already on and all that stuff. Want to install Cydia? Definitely enable battery per percentage because it's an iPod Touch 4, and enable multitasking. Next, and just let Red Snow do, do its thing. There you go. Tether jailbreak. Okay, well, it's done. Then I'm gonna have to just wait for my phone to boot up. And when it comes to the Apple screen, that's when I'm going to have to re break it again. So I'm going to come back after this is done. Okay, guys, so after that's done, then you know, I got Cydia, but it's white. And when I open it, it just crashed. So I got to just boot Tether. Then you want to click on Red Snow again. This is the new and improved Red Snow. Then you want to go to Extras. Then you want to just boot tether. Then you want to do it all over again. You want to put it in DFU mode. Home and power for 10 seconds. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Release the power button. Keep holding on to the home button for another 10 seconds. 4, 5, 6, and then. There you go, release the power the, the home button and just watch it work. And this would also work for 4.3.3, 3, 4.3.2, 4.3.4, 3, 4 4.3.1, all the good firmwares. I mean, and for the beta version, if you got like a beta firmware like iOS 5, then you would have to, um, when you click on Red Snow, you would have to go to Extras down here. And then go like 
just search for your whatever one you want to like fetch your firmware, fetch your blobs. You could do that. I mean, you could get your IPSW, like if you're on a beta version, you want to select your IPSW. But if you're not, you could just you could just hit jailbreak and you don't have to use your IPSW, you just hit jailbreak, it'll recognize it and it'll do everything for you. So I'm gonna come back after this is done guys. There it is. Just gotta open up. Let's go to City and see if City works. There you go. Put in my password real quick. Then when I go to user, just choose whichever one you want, hit done. There you go, city are working fine on the 4.3.5 firmware. Just you broken with the red snow. Let's see what 9.9.90 oh, I mean point one or whatever. Beta one. So there you go guys, it's your boy Ashadan eleven. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs up, hit the subscribe button right up there please and love y'all.